Well, also tonight, the owner of the transit drive in is trying to make his friends Godzilla of a wish come true. He's battling stage four kidney cancer at Roswell Park, and he's hoping to see a new movie before it's too late. He, he's loved Godzilla for his entire life. Um, he's like a little kid at the movies. If there's one thing George Root loves, it's Godzilla. It's something he and transit drive-in owner Rick Cohen have in common. I remember when the first Godzilla movie uh, was announced and George was so excited. He said, you going to play it? Can you play it? When's it going to come out? Rick and George go way back. I've known George for probably about 20 years. Um, he's a longtime customer at the drive-in theater. I've known his family. His son worked for me at the drive-in theater. Uh, we've hung out, watched Super Bowls together. I, was invited to his home for Thanksgiving. George was diagnosed with renal cell carcinoma a few years ago. He was doing pretty well until just recently. Unfortunately, it, the last couple months, it started to really catch up. And um, there were some tumors that emerged that were inoperable. He was put into the ICU this weekend. And I came to see him on Monday. And I walked into the room, and the first thing he says to me is, King of Monsters. And I had to ask him, you know, what, what, what'd you say? <laughs> what, what, what did you just call me? George was talking about Godzilla, King of the Monsters, which is set to come out in May. Knowing that George's time was short, Rick wanted to try his hardest to get George a private screening of the movie early. I do know the president of the Theater Owners Association, and I, I got in touch with him this morning. And, and he said he was going to bump it up and he has the contacts of Warner Brothers, so I know people who know people. If they get the okay from the movie's director and producer, the North Park Theater is offering George its space so he doesn't have to go too far. It would be great for George. You know, I'd love to see George with a smile on his face and, and just you know, give him two hours of happiness. So Rick says making this happen is a long shot, but he's got a shot. He has that connection and we can really help out by sharing it on social media, getting the word out and through the magic of social media. Maybe that movie will come here early. Let's hope so. George has been a longtime Facebook friend of mine and he posted on there also. So if you want to give him a little word of encouragement, yeah. just go to his Facebook page also. Do a shout out for George. That's right. All right.